Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today, I'm bringing you a Chris London build in NBA 2K20. For those of you who do not know who Chris London is, he is a pretty popular YouTuber. He makes a bunch of IRL videos and 2K videos, so I'm pretty sure everyone knows who he is. He's one of my favorite YouTubers, personally. But yeah, I decided to make his build today, and I'm gonna go ahead, put him at power forward. I decided to go with the playmaking shooting pie chart, because that's something Chris loves to do. He really likes to shoot the ball, he can shoot pretty well, and he also has a pretty great handle for someone his size. Now for the physical pie chart, decided to go with the pie chart with the max speed and low strength, because although Chris London is six foot ten, he is super skinny. I just follow along as I set the attributes. Three finishing badges, it's honestly like really don't need any more than that. Maybe I can get extra and get four, but like, Chris ain't like the best at finishing around the rim. I mean, it looks easy at times because he's playing people half his size, but like, I feel like he tries to avoid the paint and scoring inside because of his injury history. But he definitely likes to take contested shots outside rather than actually go down low post up and try to score a contested shot inside. Because there's a lot of times he'll be back in like much shorter opponent down in the paint and he'll shoot a fadeaway instead of taking the extra dribble or two and going up for a layup. Yeah, for the height, I'm gonna go ahead, raise it up to six foot 10. The weight, gonna lower this all the way down to 200 pounds. And for the wingspan, honestly, I don't wanna really raise it up any. He does have a pretty long wingspan, but you see it takes down the shooting. So I think I'm just gonna leave it where it's at. Actually, I'll just go ahead and bump it up one. Now for the takeover, gonna give him sharp shooting takeover. Let me see if we have built a playmaking four. Now on some badges, you see I managed to get five finishing, 19 shooting, nine playmaking, and three defensive. So I'm gonna go ahead and go to the defensive badges. We'll probably just go gold intimidator, but I'm gonna go silver intimidator and bronze rim protector. Chris is very tall, so definitely need that intimidating badge on. People drive into the paint, you know. They're gonna be a little bit nervous because you got someone that's six foot ten, has a really long reach in there. For the shooting badges. Gotta give him Hall of Fame range extender. He likes to take really deep threes. Give him go quick draw. He has a pretty fast jump shot. Give him go green machine, go with hot zone hunter. Put on silver deep fades because he likes to shoot some post fadeaways. Now I'll probably give him gold dead eye. He likes to shoot a lot of contested shots. And for the last badge, I'll just go ahead and throw it on bronze catch and shoot. Now if you wanted to, you could probably just throw on Lob City Finisher on gold. And put one on Acrobat and Fancy Footwork. Because he takes some really contested like layups and he hits some crazy layups. But, and then for the fancy footwork, I've seen him use the hop step some, and also I've seen him do Euro steps when he's driving inside. But I don't know, this is really personal preference. I'm just trying to see what would best fit him. And I think this combo will work. But yeah, guys, comment down below. What are the builds you'd like to see me make? But yeah, there's my Chris London build in NBA 2K20. Hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe to the channel if you're brand new. But anyways, guys, until next time, peace.